Someone here is so stressed out that they don't even have time to think about their other options and these people that they put you in competition with. We have the Queen of Cups, Queen of Swords, and Knight of Swords. So this person had three different options. You were one out of these three. He or she decided to possibly turn their back on you, juggle you, um, be wishy-washy towards you, betray you in some way. And now this person is sitting in their own muck in their own deceit, in their own trials, in their own tribulations. This person is stressed out because they know that they burnt the bridge with you so badly that the chances of you coming back to them is none and none. And this person is fully aware that you're just about to get new love with this Ace of Cups. Whether you're single or dating, you will meet someone new. It's inevitable because you're very loving, caring, nurturing, compassionate. Out of these options, it should have been obvious to this person that you were the best out of all these connections because for one this queen of swords is nasty probably has a nasty lifestyle nasty habits um this person is the one that is the main conspirator they, they're the one that created the main blockage and then we have this knight of swords which is the person that created the most issues and insecurities for the one that you just left behind they thought that having all these options was viable and maybe they kept it going for a little while for a little while Whoever you were connected to had their ego all blown up because they felt like they had all these people chasing after them. But you were the true light because you have some sort of intuitive connection with this person. It may be even telepathic. It's like you can pick up when this person is thinking about you, when they're going through things. They thought that being sneaky, being underhanded, being conniving, making all these false promises, cheating behind your back, um, being deceptive sexually as well. They thought it wasn't, it wasn't going to come back to them because they're used to treating people like options. Oddly enough, you closing the door on this person has made them fall in love with you because you were the only one that had the guts or even the self-respect to stand up for yourself and this person knows that they messed this up with you so badly it says i messed this up i burned the bridge due to being arrogant how do i even fix this i'm paying for what i did to you in ways that you cannot even imagine i've learned the hard way this person is so stressed out on you that they don't even care who's reaching out people are just getting blocked um they're lashing out on the other options because look these people are burdened they're burdened because they're now in the period of not receiving any attention, any time. Meanwhile, while you were connected to this person in the past, they neglected you for these other options. And now these other options aren't even getting any attention or time. It's like crazy how everything just goes full circle. It says, if I have, if I could have one chance, one more chance with you, I would do things differently this time and love you more. I'm even having a hard time talking, which means this person is like tongue tied. They can't even believe how they set themselves up for failure my friends went to f you secretly and it pisses me off the topic was brought up so they're going to be friends that got into this person's ear speaking to them against you and the whole reason why was because they actually wanted you for themselves and if there was any competition that family or friends tried to side with against you it was simply because of wealth or some value that this family or a group of friends knew that they would get so with this group of friends they knew that you had boundaries structure you were someone who was honorable and you weren't just going to throw everything that you worked for away for a group of people that you know mistreat you unlike these other pygmies or these other people that are just willing to succumb to whatever the environment is asking of them you're not like that you stand on your own two feet and that's actually good that you did that because you're releasing someone who wasn't good for you in the first place for ultimate love ace of cups ace of wands this is a person that's going to keep you satisfied in all aspects the chemistry and passion between you and this new person is going to be off the charts and you're going to have to leave this past ex in this energy of where they don't even have time to enjoy options because they're too busy dealing with their own mental health issues. They may have summoned um, certain things that are just eating up their mind, literally. And here you are breaking free while these other people are dealing with their destructive um, habits of themselves. And you're away from that.